This is Amy Chapman for 12 Puppy, and this is Pilaf. Welcome to Growing Up Guide Pub. This week we're getting Pilaf ready to start heading out and about into public and working on her public manners. But before we can do that, we need to get her used to wearing a head collar. Now before we can take Pilaf out into public, we need to make sure she can walk nicely on a leash. So we've been practicing at home. Pilaf naturally seems to be walking pretty well on a leash. She doesn't do a whole lot of pulling and running ahead. She seems to stick right by me. But like most puppies, she does try to pick up a lot of things on the ground like leaves and pebbles and basically anything that's out in front of her, especially when the wind's blowing and things are blowing and she's very attracted to chasing things. The head collar allows me to keep control of Pilaf's head to help keep her from picking up unwanted objects. Puppies want to naturally explore their environment with their mouths, which means they pick up a lot of things. But in Pilaf's case, because she's a guide dog puppy, we don't want her trying to pick up anything other than her toys. So the head collar is a great tool for us to use. Once Pilaf was comfortable wearing her head collar, it was time to get her out and about in public. This is one of Pilaf's first experiences going into a store, and she's been handling it really well. Pilaf doesn't seem to be phased by the change of surfaces on the slick floor, the aisles, the bright lights, or even the other people shopping. Now at home, we've noticed that Pilaf does respond to a lot of movement, like the cats. So we were curious to see how she handled the shopping cart because they move and they have wheels and it's something she hasn't seen before. Matt had the shopping cart and I had Pilaf. So she didn't seem to be bothered by the shopping cart being really close next to her and just continued walking and staying focused on what I wanted her to do. So, so far she is handling all of this really well. The final challenge on this outing for Pilaf was at the checkout counter. Now it can be kind of hard for a puppy to sit still while you unload a cart and pay for your purchases. Pilaf did really well. She mostly sat next to me while we unloaded the cart and allowed us to pay and then just was ready to go. She didn't try to bite anything on the floor or lunge after anything in the aisles and did a really great job on her first outing on camera. So my job as a puppy racer is to make sure that Pilaf is comfortable and well behaved out and about in public. Now we have noticed that she has a little bit more of an excitability factor than Ricky did at this age. So right now we're keeping Pilaf's outings really short, 15-20 minutes max, just until she is more comfortable and a little bit more reliable on her behavior. So keep watching and we'll see you next time on Grown Up Guide Pup.